What is good, YouTube? We touches from me touches world. I'm here for another card reaction video, and this card is called Draw of Destiny. And as you can see from the artwork, the artwork looks kind of cool. It looks like that's Yugi's hand. Um, yeah, it has to be Yugi's head. And I see in the artwork a dark magician, an exodia, and a black luster soldier. Um, so that's actually kind of lit. I like the artwork. The artworks of Yugi are, I, I gotta say, Konami, your artworks have been getting fabulous. I'm telling you that right now. Like, great work on artwork. Some of your cards and their effects have been a little iffy for me, but your artwork has been on point lately. So keep it up. Whoever's doing the art for y'all, keep let them keep them. Keep it up. Alright, this card is um, known as De a Draw of Destiny. It's a normal spell card. You only got to give me one card with this card's name per turn. If your life points are lower than your opponent's, and your opponent controls the monster on the field with the highest attack, if it is a tie, your opponent must control every tied monster. For the rest of this turn, after this card resolves, cannot... Uh, for the rest of this turn, this card is resolved. You cannot set spells and traps, and you can only activate a card slash effect one time. Also, reveal three cards with different names from your deck. And if you do, shuffle them and return them to the top of your deck, then draw one card. I don't understand this. Like, what, what what's the purpose of this card? Like, how many of this are you playing? And were you planning on it to get this bad? Like, this is one of those cards that... This is one of those cards to where it's like, you would use this just to get your last piece of Exodia. Or to get a card you absolutely would need to win the duel. But the fact of the matter is, I don't, like, someone, someone, like, put what this card could do. So maybe I don't have the full effect. Maybe this is not all of it. But someone, like, because it says return them to the top of the deck. And I don't know if that means you can choose what order they're in. Or you just randomly shuffle and put them all back and... I'm assuming you get to choose. So the fact that this card could be a good card if you need the final piece of Exodia and it's in your deck, uh, you can use this to get it if you can choose the place. But like the game has to be going seriously wrong for you to actually use this. And like, that's kind of bad. Like this card, I could see you playing it if you're like playing just for fun, like if you're like, like me. We just play for fun, so it's like I could see you playing this if you're just playing this for fun. But if you're playing this in like any deck just to play it, it's kind of wild. Um, I don't, I'm, I love the artwork, I think the artwork's the best thing of the card. The effect is kind of like this is the card you would activate if it's going wrong. I think this card reminds me of Vengeful Goddess, where you have to like draw her and it can be the only card you have. Like the game has to be so raw, you have to top, top, uh, top draw it. So it's like one of those cards for me. And like it has so much, like so much has to be going on for you to even play this card. Your opponent has to be kicking your butt seriously. Like you have to, like, your life ones have to be lowered his, uh, well theirs. Um, they have to have the highest attacking monster. Like you, the game has to be not going your way for you to even play this card. And the fact that you even drawing it, which means you're playing three, which means you expect to go into this duel knowing you're about to lose. And that, that to me, kind of, eh, an Exodia, maybe. I would play this in an Exodia deck. If you really feel like an Exodia deck, you can't stall with an Exodia deck, this would be the only card I could see you actually play it in. But um, if you feel different than me, let me know in the comments. Tell me what decks you think this could be played in. If it's actually a good card to me, it's not. The artwork is the best thing of the card. I love the artwork. Um... But if you feel differently, let me know in the comments. Uh, that's going to be the end of the video. I'll release you from this Genjutsu. Peace.